हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज कुमार कासम लीगल इंटर फ्लैक्सिंग कंपनी लेट्स सी दिस केस यंग वर्सेस पिस्टल एयरप्लेन को लिमिटेड 1944 इन दिस केस दिस इज द केस ऑफ इंग्लिश कोर्ट इन दिस केस इट वाज एस्टैब्लिश दैट द कोर्ट ऑफ अपील इज बाउंड टू फॉलो इट्स ऑन डिसीजन बट देयर आर फ्यू एक्सेप्शंस व्हेन देयर आर कंफ्लिक्टिंग डिसीजंस ऑफ दिस कोर्ट then the court is entitled to bound and decide which of the previous conflicting decisions it would follow second the court is bound to refuse to follow decision of its own which it cannot stand with the decision of the house of lords that is when there is already a decision of the house of lords then the court is bound to follow the decision of the house of lords third in the scenario when the court has this taken decision and something statutory were not brought before the court that is court was ignorant of that statutory rules then the court is not bound to follow the decision of its decision of its own if the decision was given for inquiry that is where the statutes or rule having living statutory effect would have affected the decision which was not before the brought before the attention of the court so thank you See you in the other video.